Alright, welcome back to The Walking Dead. Really ominous opening title screen, all blood red and sunsetty, setting the mood for probably not a very good bit of time. So, yeah, we just made our escape, and half the group got split up. So, amid the ruins, let's see what happens. Previously on The Walking Dead. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge. Now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. <laughs> Fucker. When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. Go on. You don't need to see this. I'm not going anywhere. Zombie bite. All right, we did just cut Sarita's arm off, so hopefully we were fast enough that the infection doesn't spread. It would be nice to have at least one person didn't turn into a zombie. But I don't think she's going to be very happy with what I did. Oh, oh, really? Serena? No! Where are you going? Kenny! Serena! Kenny! You can't die. I won't let you die. You have to move. There's too many. Come on, babe. Kenny! She's dead, man. Leave her alone! She was bit. I had to do it. How fucking dare you, Clementine! Okay, we did not make Clint Isn't Kenny happy. Like this. Kenny! I won't be left alone again. We're gonna leave. We're, we're gonna get out of this. Kenny! I don't care what you fuckers are saying. You're gonna be fine. She's already dead. You have to leave her. It's hard, Kenny, I know, but we gotta go. I'm sorry. I love you. Kenny! Damn it, man! Come on! No way, Clementine. No fucking right! I was trying to save her. Well, sorry. No, 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 no. Dodge, 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 dodge! Oh, crap. No! Ah, crap. Wasn't expecting to have to duck. Ah. <sighs> Okay, and, and duck. I'm going after Sarah! Luke! Uh. Kenny! Stay calm. Stay calm, Glenn. We can get out of this. Or we can just hide underneath the walker until the horde passes. No, don't leave the axe. Get okay, good, good. We got the axe. Good. Can't lose our weapon here. Yep, re-up your... Nice, fresh zombie guts. Keep us safe. Err, Zombie. Err. I'm gonna keep quiet. The others have gotten away. We just have to go find them. Would you? Why would you sneak up on somebody and hug somebody? Tap me on the shoulder. Crying out loud. Well, first we shut up. We can't stay here, Rebecca. We 
We're gonna meet up with them at that uh, historic site thing. Probably because they've got assault rifles shooting at them. Please tell me you're not having the baby. We may not want to be here. Maybe they're thinning out somewhere. Do you see any openings? Anything? There. Damn it! Go back, go back! Jane! Jane, thank God. Stop. Relax. Yeah, we don't have to clear out a path. Slowly. Her brains. Just stay calm and follow her. Together like this, it's better if we spread out. You two will be fine. No, you don't understand. Just help us. You guys are fine. Just all right. We'll spread out. Rebecca's not gonna like it. Spread out. We'll spread out. You said you would stay with me. Just stay calm. We can do this. Making noises is not going to help us here. Damn it. We'll have to push through that cluster of walkers. There's too many. There's too many in all directions. Just. We need. A what? You'll see. There. That one looks light enough to carry. A cow catcher? I need you to get her attention. Okay. Hey, over here. This seems like a bad plan. Ah. Can't bite us. I see. Smart. Stay close. If you fall behind, I can't come back for you. Alright. Don't fall behind, okay. That is really smart. Ah, so we just use her to shove through. Oh, that is good. I'm staying with this girl. She knows what she's doing. Well, at least we're through the horde. That's good news. You okay back there? That baby better not be coming. That baby's coming. Oh, boy. Please, please hold out for a while. Is everything all right? No, I'm not all right. But I'll be a lot better once we get with the others. I need to make sure everyone else made it out. Luke, Sarah, Kenny. God. What if they aren't there? Well, then we have a three-person survivor group. Nothing we can do about it. Don't yep. even say things like that. Fine. Sorry. Jesus. I don't even know if we're safe. What if the herd is still following us? As long as you're Fine. quiet, they won't. It's been quiet, but who knows? We gotta keep going. We'll watch out for each other. So long as we keep up a good pace. I know, I know. Just... I'm going as fast as I can. I know I should feel glad that we escaped, but I just can't stop thinking about the others. It was stupid. What was? Escaping? Look, I know we all agreed to use the herd to get out, but maybe we should have been more patient. Come up with something better. It worked. If you can call that working, we could have... I don't know. The plan worked. We got out of there. It was a little Most messy. Look, we lost a couple I know that people. Some of your people didn't make it, but Carver was crazy. Exactly. Staying would have only prolonged the inevitable. I'm just saying that if people hadn't panicked, 
Things might have turned out better. Of course. We panicked. We were scared. The plan was good. The execution was the messy part. That sounds an awful lot like you're saying it was their fault. What? No. No, that's not what I'm saying. Just... Ugh. Okay, I stitched my own arm, but I am not delivering I'm a sorry. baby. I don't want to slow us down. Can I just have a minute? Uh, yeah. Take a minute. Thank I like you. her. She's nice, too. Strong, survival oriented, but still nice enough to give a minute. Alvin was supposed to be here for this. Is Alvin... He's dead is what he is. Thanks to that fucking madman back there. Rebecca, are you going to be okay? What are you going to do with it? What do you mean by that? Uh, sorry. Just making conversation. It was nothing. No. What do you mean by that? Do with what? My baby? I'm just looking at the worst case scenario. The walking scenario. dinner bell you we're about to have. people to raise a baby by yourselves. Not out here. I just mean it's going to need food. And, you know, other stuff. Yeah? And? And we'll look after it together. Even if that's the case, you can't always protect everyone. Yeah, it looks like we're stuck with it. I'd well, much I rather... Be capable enough. Just because you're some angry loner who doesn't care about anyone but herself doesn't mean you know better than me. Hey, I've seen it before. Would you two calm down? Back when it started, me and my sister, we what? were... She died? Whoa. I don't need your pity. You don't... You don't have the right... Jane! Great. Shit, I didn't mean it. Shit. She didn't mean it. Right? She just said she didn't mean it. <gasps> Damn it. One big happy family. Soon to be joined by a screaming poop machine that will draw every walker within 15 miles. Can't just sit here doing nothing. I know, I know. They'll be here soon. Holy shit. All right, group is now it five. Been so long. We were starting to worry no one else would make it. Well, besides. Now, hopefully we can figure out a plan. How's Kenny? I tried to talk to Kenny. He flipped out on me. Started yelling. Scary shit. I know. He probably didn't mean it. But it was scary. Okay, he's got a gun. Kenny, Kenny, we're going to need to take the gun away from you. Just as a precaution. I've been nervous to even go near him. What? You think he's gonna shoot you? The way he is right now? I don't know. Maybe. He's not acting rationally. He's just... He's not thinking straight. Uh, well, he's gotta do my fault she died. I, I tried to save her by cutting it off so the bite wouldn't get infected, it. but she freaked this out, my fault. pulled a more hey, zombies onto you her. did what you thought was right. That's all anyone can do in that situation. And I still gotta fess up to it. Well, if I hadn't, she'd have been bitten, and then Sorry, we'd have her here. God, wherever you are, please forgive me. I can't be alone again. Oh, no, Ken Kenny, we're taking the gun. We are taking the gun from Kenny. Hi, Kenny. Hello, angry Kenny. You think I don't know what y'all are whispering about over there? What's okay, wrong? angry, paranoid Kenny. Why is Kenny acting that way? Do you think Kenny's okay? It's because we're concerned for you, Kenny. anyone anymore. Somebody needs a hug, and we're going to give you a hug now. I, I should apologize. Kenny, I'm so sorry about Sarita. Sorry, huh? Well, that's nice of you, seeing as this was your fault in the first place. Kenny, I'm trying to be nice here. There was nothing I could do. Seeing how things turned out... I think I might have preferred if you do nothing. Wow. I tried to save her. You think because you're a little girl, you can just get people killed and no one will care? That because you're sorry, it'll all magically go away? Kenny, lay off a clam. That's not how it works. I like you, Kenny. You're tough and smart, sort of. You're... Good with a gun, maybe not with your depth perception not issues. Not the last time. Just 
Get the fuck out of here and leave me alone. I'm going crazy just sitting here not doing anything. Just give it time, Mike. It's still early. Clem, how'd it go? Kenny's really mad at me. Clem, you can't just expect him to... No, no, back. he's got to take some time, but we have apologized. At least you tried. Still... Doesn't exactly help us figure out what we're going to Step do. one, get the we gun away food, from Kenny. The water is getting damn cold, and we're losing daylight fast. When the others get back, they'll know what to do. Luke will have a plan. Or you can just rely on Kenny me to have a plan. plan. Mike, Bonnie. <sighs> Mike's got a point. You can't just keep sitting around waiting. Things are difficult enough right now, and soon you'll have a baby on your hands too. What, suddenly you're pretending to be concerned? Seeing you people floundering the minute things don't go according to plan, it's just got me on edge, all right? Well, I don't exactly see you stepping up to help right now, either. This was the meeting place. We should stay here and try to make it safe. Clementine's right. If we leave here, they'll never find us. Well, we can leave okay, him a note, fine. but In the meantime, give him a day we'll or two. Clem and we can go look that way. See if we find him. Clem okay, as long as there's still a group here. Carver's. I want her watching my back. Yeah, yeah, I trust you to watch my back, too. If they're alive, they can't be far. We can find them, one way or the other. Thank you. Listen, Rebecca, if anything goes wrong here, you got something to protect yourself? I've got this. You don't think I'd need to... I don't know, but you better keep that close. And maybe we should take Come Kenny's on, gun away from him. He does have a family history of suicide. Well, sort of. Look, I'm gonna level with you. I was just looking for an excuse to get out of there for a bit. And you should know that finding your friends, that's a shot in the dark. Oh, I already knew it. Uh. It didn't look good. You're probably right. Yeah. So, I wanted to talk to you away from them. You wouldn't have made it this far if you weren't smart, but I still... I just gotta warn you. That group is cracking. I've seen it before. Yeah, I'm kind of trying to hold it together, but... Of times, yeah. It's better to be on your own. I know you see what I'm talking about. You don't want to be here when they start turning on each other. Turning on you. You know, bad stuff happens to you when you're alone, too. But your odds are better. There's nobody to watch your back. And when something does happen, there's nobody there to help you. How much help is Kenny gonna be? What he's going through? He's more of a liability than anything. And Rebecca's situation is not making things better back there. You get enough broken people together, and all you're gonna get are broken decisions. Let's ask more about Jane. Have you just kept to yourself this whole time? Of course not, but sometimes you gotta learn the hard way. I'm trying to save you that trouble. For what it's worth, I like most of the people in your crew, but groups fall apart. People get killed. When the group falls apart, do you want me to go with you? Then why did you bring me with you? I'm just trying to give you the tools you need to make it. Like your jacket. It looks warm, but a walker will bite right through that. My sister Jamie had a good leather one. Wish I still had it. You leather jacket, it. there you go. Alright, I'll be on the lookout for a leather jacket. Oh, do you need a hug too? Everybody needs a hug today. What what happened to your sister? <laughs> Seems we always want to talk about the end, don't we? I just want some backstory so I can you understand know, being you better. A big sister is, well, it's funny. It's really easy to be mean. Oh? You know, hide her toys, 
Make fun of her bad haircut. Give her the bad haircut on purpose. <laughs> I mean, I did put the gum there. I figured I should get it out. I don't even know why. Is that really what it's like having a sister? No, no. It's not all bad. But I like Jane. What could I do? She thought I was her best friend. I couldn't go unpunished. <laughs> okay. Every summer we'd go to this amusement park in Virginia. But the best part wasn't the rides. It was that nobody knew us there. And I'd I'd pretend we weren't sisters. Just friends. <clears throat> yeah, somebody really needs a hug. All right. Jackpot. Bet these walkers got some good stuff. Looting walkers. I'm liking you more and more. And double tapping. Coming back. See what else he's got. Yeah, we should check him out. But you know why, right? Only because they're fresh. Take a look. Old walkers are a waste of time. They're holding credit cards and busted old pagers. Ah, the fresh These ones are survivors. Ones walkers all that long ago. They were survivors. They might have useful stuff. I really like you, Jane. Probably means you're going to be one of the ones to die in this episode, sadly. But I really like you. See what you. else he's got. I'll check this one. You have survival skills. All right. You are tasking me with looting. I can do that. Credit cards. Find anything? Driver's licenses. Two of them. Well, I guess some people just can't leave the past behind. Bullets. Score. Hold on to them. Ammo's getting hard to come by, and things aren't going to get better. Smart haircut. Thanks. So, has your crew always been so dysfunctional? You fit in there, but you weren't like them. Yeah, I think our Makes group was wonder. better before. I was with a different group before. That one worked better, I think. That was when I got my hair cut like this. These guys have a lot of their own problems. That's it. Nail file. Nail file. These things are great. Sharpen a blade, strike a flint. Jane I am sticking with you person. whenever I have the opportunity. I my hand when I went reaching in. <sighs> I'm glad you're opening up to me. Double tap. Thank you. You can never be too sure with these things. Here, give me a hand. Yep, double tap. Very good. Uh-oh. That's not exactly good. These glasses. They're Sarah's. Looks like your friend didn't make it. Well, she's not Sorry. here. I don't know what to tell you. All we know is that she was here. It could be a good sign. Don't go getting your hopes up. Well, she's not stumbling Glenn, around Glenn, undead I right now. I don't know what you want me to say, but... Yeah! Sarah! God damn it! Shit! Okay, come on. We gotta find a way in. Looks like there's an opening over there. That looks like oh, Nick. No. God. No. It's I was supposed Nick. to take care of him. Look, he's your friend. You should do this. Well, Uncle Pete, I took care of Nick. Goodbye. Oh, that did not do... Come on, Clem, we're better than this. Clem? Clem, we're really slipping here. Can we, can we just, just finish him? There we go. Damn it, Nick. It's alright. It's done. If it comes to it. 
If Luke or Sarah or anybody needs to be put down, you gotta be ready for it. No hesitation. You know that, right? It never gets any easier, does it? As in for me. That hatchet of yours seems to get stuck pretty easily. It's gonna get you killed. Here, use this. Oh, sweet ice pick. Thank you very much. Very effective. We can do this. Um, do you want to hold on to the hatchet? Because you kind of might need another melee weapon. Just calm down. They don't sound too good. Clock's she has, ticking. like, panic attacks. I'm ready. I know you are. We need to get a better look. All right. Dad. How about you get the close one, and I'll hop the fence to get the other. Oh, crap. She's talking with her dad. Go for it. Well, that's... That's not good. Get She's... Away. Hello? <laughs> oh, I like this ice pick. This is nice. This is really nice. Nice work. You know what you're doing. Now watch this. Okay, we're not having a competition. Oh, yeah, there you go. You had two ice picks? First. Then, put a knife in the back of its head when it's down. Smart. All right, let's get a look at what we've got on deck. Like a day at zombie killing school. What do you want me to do? Yep, that one was alive. Glad you're paying attention. Double tap. No, I'm not. I, I can't. No. All right, we got it's two. It'll take some work to get over there. Oh. Let's see if we can find anything over there. Come on. No. Nothing in the truck bed? Damn. We're gonna get up no keys, go. okay. Not sure if we want to use the horn. Can we talk to you? Is that an option? I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. The horn is gonna dry up everything. Let's go for the walkers. Me back ahead. You did the knee thing. Nice trick, huh? Oh, that's that's a few more. They look worked up about something. Look at Sarah screaming her head off. Noise. How do we get in? If we can make enough noise on this side, we can lure those walkers over here. Which and we might just be able to go through that other trailer and get to your friends. Also, what do you think of that? I mean, I'm just making like it up you? as I go along. Let's make some noise. Right. All right, but first Let's there is a zombie. Can can we can we look at the zombies? Because one of them is wearing a motorcycle helmet, which makes it the most dangerous zombie known to man. That one is going to be an issue. Let's talk to her some what more. What am I looking for? See if you can find something to distract them. Like that one's going to cause problems. Um, all right, let's see if we get any new information. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. Then we got to draw them away. What do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen zombies, including the motorcycle helmet one. All right, banging on the barricade. We'll give it a try. I don't think it's going to. Well, maybe we'll draw just one or two. Might break up the group. There we go. Got a little bit of a tip. No. Stop making noise inside the damn... Ugh. Fine. Want me to honk the horn? I'll honk the horn. Damn it, don't do this. Really? It's good, but we need to keep it going somehow. Okay. 
We need a stick or something. Um, can we poke? Oh, no, we killed that dead walker. See if he's got anything. Aha, he might have the keys. Sheriff, what the hell? What are you thinking? We should search him. Always time for looting. Not all of them are winners. All right. Can we put him on the horn now? What are you thinking? If we lean him on the horn, he'll keep honking and draw the walkers. Just like moths to a flame. Give me a hand. And I trust her. She took it down, so she obviously knows how to keep making sure it's down. <laughs> that damn motorcycle zombie. He's gonna be an issue. How do you... I think we have to take the head off with the motorcycle zombie. Behind us. Behind us, Clem. Nice and easy. Come on. Crap. We gotta move it. Why did the horn stop? Horns don't stop. It's locked. Then try something else. Oh, sh You're gonna need to use more force than that. Put some muscle into it. I'll hold them off. Just We're really gonna kick there. the door down? It's it's safe. All right. Hurry! This is not good. Breaking in through our safety area. So I totally just damaged the lock this? on that door. Hurry! Okay, it looks like it's Luke and Sarah. Clem? Oh, thank God. Did Nick find you? He made a run for it. Looking for help. He did not make it far. I saw him outside. Look, he was out there. But we took care of him. You know. Fuck. You need a hug? Fuck. When I heard y'all banging through the door, I thought the walkers come to take what's left of us. We gotta get moving. I'll second that. Well, I would have left already, but I... I got Sarah here, and I, I don't know what to do about her. What's the matter? She's having a panic attack. Gotta help. I'll do it. <sighs> Sarah, look. Look, it's Clem. See, it's just like I told you. They're okay. Hey, Cle Hey, Sarah. Got your glasses. Sarah, come on. We, we have to go now. Come on. We need to get out of here. Guys, we can't do this. We can't, we can't, we can't stay here. I don't know what to do. I can't snap her out of it. Okay, I tried to carry her, but I, I guess Carver messed me up pretty good back there. <sighs> I don't know, it was just after Carlos, she just lost it. Started running through the woods like a maniac. I, I, I chased her for I don't know how long, and then while well, she saw this mobile home made a beeline right for her. I'm just glad y'all are here. Okay, we, 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 we're kind of on a timeline here. What are we gonna do about her? We gotta do something. Maybe she'll listen to me. Maybe. Listen, I, uh... They're gonna tear this place open pretty soon. We, we can't Well, stay. if we stop talking so and let me talk to her... We gotta get her up, or, or we gotta... Alright. Well, I've been trying. I've been trying for hours. I can barely get her to look at me. Well, she doesn't have her glasses well, on. Maybe she's nearsighted. Sarah, it's me. The pinky promise. Hi. Yay, we got a word out of her. No! <laughs> okay. Shit. Yeah, she's freaked. Okay, so nobody wants a hug today. Maybe it seems like you're all alone right now, but you're not. Yes, I am. Well, what about Luke and Jane and me? We came here because of you. All of us in the group, we're your family now. <laughs> mm. 
Sarah, we are really on a timeline here. We're surrounded. I don't want to leave you behind. What about the skylight? Oh, we got. Clem, there's no time. Clem. Listen, Jane might be right. When everything started, I met my friend Lee. He tried to help me find my parents. He protected me more than anyone else in my whole life. He died to keep me safe. I was so scared. But you're still here. Because he taught me to be strong, even when I'm scared. Because he wanted me to live. And your dad protected you because he wanted you to live. He would still want that. There you go, Clem. Good job. Good job. Come on, Sarah. Come on, Sarah. Yes, we got her back. All right, now we need to move fast. Get to the skylight now! Come on, no, Luke. Jane, don't be a hero. Let Luke do it. What's going on back there? My ribs. We're gonna need something to stand on. Luke, get over here. Help me hold this. Clem, see what you can find. All right, quick looting. Fridge, no. Milk crate. Can we use this? It's not big enough. Can we use that? It's all we can yeah, use. That would work. What? Oh, shit. Yep. Okay. Ready? On three. One, two, three. Aw, oh, Luke, switch places. If I'm going to lose somebody, I'd rather lose you than the girl who knows how to survive and loot. Clem! Clem, help her! Help Jane! Okay, go! Go! Keep pushing! Go! Jane? 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 Good job, Jane. There's, there's one on the ground, Jane. Jane, there's one on the ground. Watch out for that ankle biter. Yay! Whew. Luke, you first. We need you up top. He can't lift shit. Well, I guess he can't. Uh, 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 okay, come on. Clem. Sarah first. Sarah, we have to go. Are you listening? I can't do it. Now, Clementine! If she doesn't want to go, you can't make her. Don't let her take you down, too. Not again. Sarah, you're going. I can't! I can't! I can't! Daddy! Don't make me leave you! Come on! Dying like this is stupid! You can't save her, Clem. We have to go! Believe me, I know about this. Hurry up! Oh, move! <laughs> Clementine! Grab her! Oh, no, no, no! No, 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 not Jane, not Jane, not Jane! Jane, 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 Jane! No bite on the leg, no bite on the leg. Whew. We gotta go. Sarah. Come on. Well, Sarah's not gonna be happy, but she's alive. Sometimes you have to be the bad guy. to ask this but are we there yet <laughs> we're not far look sarah you can get through this we both will but i'm not okay just try can you do that also sorry for she slapping you time clem leave her be for a bit okay just, can we have someone walking behind her? Because if she wanders off, that's I don't know not about good. This. The way she is, she's gonna cause problems. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just, I'd seen that kind of thing before. I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. So that's Sorry, how your sister died. I, I don't mean to sound harsh. It's just the way things are. 
It's okay. I get it. Things aren't always simple. And just because you got her out of there today, doesn't mean you saved her. Trust me. I tried to save Jamie too, but she gave up. I just... I can't believe it. As soon as you guys said go, I was the first one up on the roof. Like I had already made up my mind. Luke. Hey, I was gonna leave, but the slab didn't right work. Here. I mean, I can't... I can't fault you for anything. Well, I can't forget it. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning, she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her. Or push her. Or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time... Walkers cornered us. Forced us up to the roof. And, and when they kept coming, I... I couldn't make her jump. Couldn't throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted. And I left her there. Jumped to the next building over by myself. You left your sister? Jane, I'm really sorry. It killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell. When all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Sarah was that way too. Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Sarah and Jamie aren't the same person. We don't know if she'll end up like that. People don't change. Still doesn't make it the same Come case on. as your sister, though. Let's get though. back to your friends. But yes, I am... Well, I'm... We're gonna have a baby on the way. I'm kind of carrying this group as it is. Kenny's mad at me. Honestly, if Jane asked me to leave with her right Son now, I think that'd be a you fun zombie-killing adventure. Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, I don't know what would have happened. Sarah... How you doing, hon? She's That's a little... Okay, sweetie. Yeah. Whenever you're ready. I'm just glad you're here. Maybe you can talk to Kenny, and Wait, the two of you can get better me. together. <sighs> uh, Rebecca, how about we, uh, we go for a walk for a minute? Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about, too. <laughs> no! No. <laughs> I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. Oh I was no. You might know. Does Luke know anything about babies? Has he? I don't know. Mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? Just in case. Maybe Kenny knows. He had a family. He could help. Where is he? Oh God! Where's Kenny? He went in there after you left. Said he needed a minute by himself. I've been gone for hours. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. well let's go in and check to see if he killed himself and he's a walker. I'll go in there. <sighs> Thank you, Clem. I really do think that might be best. <sighs> exactly, Clem. <sighs> do you have any options first? Can we look around a little bit? Nope. Looks like we are only going in there. Oh, boy. Oh, where the hell are you going, Clementine? All right. It's a lot of crows. Kenny, are you a walker? How you doing? We need your help with Rebecca's baby. No one else knows what to do. You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death. Probably not good. Peaceful. 
It feels peaceful. Oh, you're it's giving like up, I Kenny? Was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. How much brain damage did you get, Kenny? Come on. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating every day. Okay. Gotcha, Sarita. No peace, no rest. The punches just keep coming. Keep on, talk it out. Let's work this out. Come on. Why the hell couldn't Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. You help me all the time. That's not true. You help me all the time. Do we still have the picture of Kenny? I need you. <sighs> I've seen you take care of yourself more than any three adults put together. Okay, I'm I'm a badass, but Kenny, come Thanks on. For saying that. Step back from that ledge. Now, nah, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Yay! The old Kenny is sort of back. Anyway. Maybe one of the others can look at it for you. Oh shit! Does that mean what I think it does? What are we supposed to do? Oh god. We should see what's going on. Wait. Was Kenny vomiting blood? Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. That's how it feels. Er, what's water broke. On? Lovely. Rebecca's water broke. Mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. That means the baby's coming, right? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. Yay, no Kenny saves the day. A trap like this. He's right. She's going to make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. It hurts more than before. Is something wrong? What should we do first, Kenny? Kenny, come on. You got to focus. Give him a minute. Right, right. Sorry. Clean water for one thing. And blankets. And we gotta get out of this damn cold, too. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. 1.2 miles? Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca. And I will check the perimeter for walkers. Sarah? Sarah? You just stay here with Rebecca and Kenny, okay? Clem. Can I go, Jane? I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mac a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking, how do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Oh, she's Maybe fine. She with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I trust Jane. Yeah. I mean, I would have never made it back without her. Just something to think about. Can I go with Jane? But if I go with Bonnie, does Bonnie not make it back? Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfecting. That all sound right? Don't worry. Alright, there's two of you. I'm gonna go with Jane. Gonna be fine. Maybe I should go with Jane. Better hurry and catch up, then. Alright, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful. I like Jane, and if she's going to leave, I am going with her. But Kenny's back to normal-ish, so I don't know if I want to leave the group. Uh, I was not expecting her to be sitting there moping. Um, quickly check for walkers. Nothing to loot. Yeah, it's a good thing we came this way. Bonnie and Mike seem pretty decently capable of taking care of themselves. Oh, hey. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. You seem a little Just bit out of it. happened today. And I don't know if... 
Well, it's sometimes good to have someone watching you. Yay! Jane's staying. Or at least staying with me. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. All right. right. Partner? Don't let it get to your head. Oh, Let's come go. on. I hope this place is what we're looking for. God knows we could use a break. Okay, you need a hug. Come on, Clem. Give me the hug option. Candy didn't want it. Sarah didn't want it. Hugs make everything better. Unless they're zombie hugs. Zombie hugs do not make anything better. Check this out. This gate's still locked, which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. Also, we have a nice, strong, heavy metal door. Who knows what could be in there? That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah. We got a, we got a heavy metal door. We got stairs, so we can shoot at them while they come up the stairs. Gives us extra mm, time. Maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand at this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Okay. Yes! We are using the cannon. We could shoot the door open with a cannon. I don't care about any other options. I want to use the cannon. You think this thing still works? <laughs> Check the muzzle, Napoleon. Oh. They fill them with cement, so they're safe. Oh, I wanted to use that cannon. All my experience with zombies, I've never gotten to kill one with a cannon. I guess it's broken. Ah, uh, or we need coins. Um, I have bullets. Um, well, let's learn about the Civil War while we're here. Okay, well, let's see if there's anything in the trash can. Find anything? No, not even trash. Wait, there's no trash in the trash can? There, there, there's got to be trash in the trash can. I mean, trash can loot. Seriously? Okay. Um. What else we got? Can we talk to her some more? We can. Alright, what other options do we have? Can... The other one, or the map. Yep, let's talk to her before we lose the chance. I mean, honestly, picking it with a nail file is a little optimistic. Um... I don't think we're any good at lockpicking. Have you seen any walkers around? I haven't seen any, but they're always around. Good to know. Can we ask the rest of the conversation things? Yay. Let's keep bugging her. How can I help? If you can find anything to help me get this open faster, that'd be great. Okay. Take a look around. Do you think it'll be warmer in there? It's so cold out here. It'll keep the wind chill off at least. Better than nothing. Stop making me walk away. Got to exhaust dialogue options. I hope we find something good in there. Well, not impossible, but don't count on it. Maybe a working cannon? I'd like a working cannon. You wouldn't be able to move it, but... Man, make for one hell of a last defense. Ooh, let's find the map. You need defense line. Oh, shit. You okay? You okay? Yeah. I think I almost had it. Keep looking. Okay. Glad I got to talk. Oh, no! I can't walk back over there. There we go. 
Oh no, there's going to be something across the river that we can use, and it's not going to be good. There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind, though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Shit, shit, shit. He's coming this way. And who knows if he has friends nearby. Why is he coming up here? No idea. Maybe it's his base? But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. Last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood. Maybe I can try talking to him. Good call. Shit. Hide now. Ah, uh, great hiding place, Clem. He's obviously injured his leg recently. Maybe that's a little bit more than recently. Hey. Easy. I just want to talk to you. I'm just a kid. Who are you? Easy there. I'm Arvo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. Jane, Jane, don't do this. Okay. Back up. Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. Okay, that went better than the last attempt to take a gun from somebody. Please don't be ahead. No, I have no more guns. I swear to we you. We just need to make sure you're not... Anything? Um, drug paraphernalia. Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please. Is it just you and your sister? No. I have many friends in the woods. Sister or not, we could really use that. Well, stuff. we're not taking oh, it. You are not nice people. You have already left me defenseless, and now you, you take my sister's medicine? You are worried. Hey, we've got people who are suffering. Who need this medicine? Jane, easy. Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it. Clementine, we My need that stuff. People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special. Clementine, yes, you might. We'll do the right thing. You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Oh, Bush. Thank you, Clementine. Thank you. You come back and come after us, I'm going to kill you. But we are going to be nice today. You don't have to do this. Just let me go. Jane, don't do it. Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. Okay, that was a little bit mean to the kid. Hopefully, because we were nice to him, he's not going to call his group back here. I think we should give him his gun back. I can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? I thought we were just gonna talk to him. Oh, don't get angry with her. Make sure he didn't come back here again. Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place open. Then we need to get moved in ASAP. Oh, no, Jane. Oh. Okay, at least she's getting this place open, so she's not leaving the group, but... Oh, God, there's a group of other survivors, and they know we're here. Admittedly, we're nice to them, but... Oh, no. 
Maybe we should have just killed him and taken Clem, the meds. Clem, hey! Any luck with that observation dick? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from me in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. God knows we could use a break. Shouldn't you be with Rebecca? No, no. Kenny's way more help with Rebecca than I could be. I'm just making sure we keep track of where everyone is. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah. She's you trying met somebody. to get the gift shop opened. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but... At the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I'm never quite sure if she just done like people, or just plain out done like me. I like her. She's honest, and she knows what she's doing. Yep, that's more than I can say for some. Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just, he seems broken. And broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. But I just think he's had to take more than he can handle. You're wrong. Kenny's stronger than anyone. He tries to protect us. I don't know, Clem. I used don't to doubt your friends. That maybe all the horror hadn't gotten to you yet. But you watched your friend murder Carver. Not just kill him, but... Mm -hmm. Clem, you didn't even blink. Yeah, that was Carver. Carver deserved what happened to him. He was a bad man. No question about that. I'm just hoping we don't become the same. I'm trying to keep us from killing random people. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh, I'll see you back there. Also, you know, maybe mentioning we found some other group and they're in the area. Because if he remembers that we were nice to him, we are in trouble. And also, that was a shit ton of nothing but medicine and water, which is a little suspicious for somebody to only I'm loot to that much medicine and water. Again. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. Done talking down the crazy lady? What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Somewhere the baby will be safer? It's coming so much faster than I thought. I told you, you're getting yourself all worked up over... All right, we need to calm her down. It's high up, so it should be safe from walkers. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. Glad you made it back safe. How are you Me feeling? too. Scared, and it hurts. <laughs> Alvin was here. Well, we could have given you some medication, but we decided not to have their group attack. Alvin would be really proud of you right now. You think so? I hope you're right. You feel better now? It's a waste of time. But I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. Do we have a walkie-talkie? How am I ever going to do this without him? You're going to be a good mom. We sure have come a long way since we first met, huh? Yeah, I didn't good threaten you at all. Time. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Um, yeah, oh, babies. Shit. I got this. Babies are not good in a survival group. We ain't seen Mike or Bonnie in a while, and I'm not saying I don't trust them, but I'd appreciate it if you went and checked up on them. Yeah, going ahead. I'll be fine. Ah, uh, crap. They got themselves in trouble. Also, maybe mention to them, um, yeah. How are you feeling, Rebecca? I knew it was gonna hurt, Clem. But I didn't think it would hurt like this. Sorry, I don't have any meds for you. We could have gotten you drugged up. Kenny, there are people. There are, are other people crazy? in the woods. Sure. Why wouldn't I be? Is that all I can say to Kenny? All right, um... I really have to go 1.2 miles. If anything happens, I'm not going to get back. All right, let's look at the map, see if we know where we are. Now, uh, the other map might be a little bit more useful, Clem. It doesn't have signs all over it. Okay. 
So here we are. Um, Civil War Graveyard. No, no, here we are. We are here because there's the You Are Here sticker. There's the observation thing. If we go farther up the road, it looks like there's a Civil War Graveyard, Civil War Museum. Actually, that's a nice place up at the museum. Gives us a nice little place to look. It's farther... Oh, no, that's actually closer to downtown. Yeah, so there's a city right there. Civil War Memorial... something? Ruins. Okay. Uh-huh. And then there's a national park. I mean, there, there's, a, there's a benefit and a disadvantage of having your back to the river. I mean, you don't have to really too wor worry too much about walkers coming through the water, because they're going to be nice and slow to shoot. But you're also slower getting away if there's humans that are the issue. I hope one of these buildings is safer than out here. So there's the observation deck, there's the museum. Admittedly, spending the night near a zombie or a Civil War graveyard in a zombie apocalypse just sounds like all kinds of fun. Deck. I wonder if Mike and Bonnie have found anything at the museum. Look, Logon Park. Uh huh. Grand River. I don't actually see any bridges, which is kind of weird. When you have a major city next to a historical site, you think they had to just put a river right over there, or a bridge right across the river. Uh, what do they got downtown? There's the church we saw. Looks like a pretty small town. Maybe three, four thousand population, which is good. Small towns this are easier to loot. Like where we are right now. Yeah, that's the big You Are Here sticker. Okay, Clem, let's see. We've seen enough. We know our bearings, so we're heading farther up. All right, makes sense. All right. We'll look at the sign, and then we'll head out. Oh shit, I didn't even see Sarah over there. I could have talked to her. No. Hopefully she'll be okay without me reassuring her. Oh, this place looks terrible. It's an open air museum. Okay, hold on, Clem. Clem, we're checking the walkers. We are checking these walkers. I do not trust Bonnie and Mike to check as well as Jane does. Hey, Clem. I thought you went with Jane. She didn't take off, did she? Take off? Why do you think she'd take off? Well, it's just a... A feeling. I know Jane seems like she doesn't care about anyone, but I trust her. She's trying to get the place we found ready for Rebecca. Well, that's good. Just give me like ten more minutes to search around. He doesn't want to go back empty-handed. But I just want to help. More points to Mike. He has the looting sense. All right, first off. Keep one eye on the woods while we're in here. I don't want nothing sneaking up on us. I watch this side, you watch the other. Deal. Souvenirs, huh? Looking for a keychain with your name on it? No. Why would I want a keychain? I don't even have any keys. Ah, oh, good point. Now, keys, that'd be something really useful for the zombie apocalypse. Getting a set of uh, bump keys, which you are a special they set. They say that stuff about water and blankets just to get people out of the way. Oh, you, you know, don't know what the hell you're talking about. And you didn't have to come with me. I've no, always wondered I if that to. was actually necessary or not. Never mind. Never had the stomach to actually learn. But, like I was saying, the bump keys, locksmiths actually make, like, they're essentially skeleton keys, where you turn them and you bump them with a screwdriver and they'll pop there open sure most locks. Survival here. in the zombie puckers. Watch where you step. Yeah, so I'm really worried about stepping in poo. Jane oh, no. These don't work anymore. Nah, they're just for show. Be handy, though. Also really loud. Good point. Which would make great distractions, noted. Um, alright, can I look, look over here? I want to see what all I can mess with before I start messing with things so I don't miss anything important. Hey, Civil War coat. They yeah. are not leather. No, not so much. Unless you want some broken glass. Yeah, screw the display table. We're grabbing the coat. Hey, look at this. An old coat. Nice. Good fun, Clem. That'll work as a blanket. You should hang on to that. It's gonna get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. Kenny said we need blankets. It's not really a blanket, but... But it should do the trick. Good call. And you didn't think of this? got that old coat I gave you. I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully also, it's probably going to be really big on me. Not that I blame you if you did. 
I haven't always used the best judgment. It seems like you're with us now. That's what matters most. This part is like me keeping the entire group together. That's great, but uh, isn't Gray the, you know... Uh... Yeah, it's not the great side to pick. Put Rebecca in a Confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Guess it's better than nothing, though. Yeah, all the old previous connotations have kind of gone out the window. All right, let's look at the display table. Lee would have loved this I tell place. you, I sure don't like being near a graveyard. Thanks for interrupting me, reminiscing about Lee. All right, I'm gonna go talk to Mike because you interrupted me. In a graveyard all the time. Yeah, true enough. Also, this is an open-air museum, which is, like, the stupidest concept in the entire world. There is one room that would be safer. I'm glad we found the observation deck. Ooh, a water cooler. <gasps> if there's a water cooler, they had to have some way of refilling it, and that's inside the information booth. Oh, we can get an extra tank of fresh water, and it won't be zombie-infected or needing to be boiled or anything. Empty. There's a box. All right, let's talk to Mike and Bonnie before we start messing with things. Yep, there's the water bottle. We saw it through the window. Can we talk to Mike? No, Mikey. No? Can we talk to you? He is not a conversationalist. Do you see anything good? Not so far. But let's give the place a good going over. Find anything yet? Not really. That's really all you can say? Okay. Well, looks like you're just going to sit there and stare at the cannons and stare at the little model, and Clem is going to do all the work again and reassure you and keep you with the group and come up with the plans and come up with the rescues. I mean, you people are pretty worthless. I'd like to take Kenny with me, because he's seemed fairly recovered. I mean, he's still got issues, but it's not bad. Nothing but junk in there. Trust me. I don't trust your looting skills. I also don't trust those two zombies that you apparently killed out front, because you didn't check them. Under the box? There's a key under the box. Just watch. No? Can we... Oh, yeah. It's just going through the shutter. Score! Over here. Water! Bottled and clean. That's just what we need. It's locked. You want to kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. Meaning you want to send me through it. Some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. No, I mean, <sighs> maybe... All right, all right. I'll go. Thanks, Clem. Just open the door from the other side. Mike will carry those things out. Might be a bit heavy for you. I'll probably end up carrying them, too. There's gonna be a zombie in here. Like, I already know that. I'm stuck. Okay. Maybe I push from... Yeah, there's a... Oh, thanks. Thanks so much. Oh, I guess you could've just kicked the damn door open. Thank you very much, Mike. You are strong. Uh, Just grab that thing by the throat and throw it up against happened? the wall. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. Thanks, Mike. Yeah. No problem. I'm so sorry about that, Clementine. We should have been more careful. Yeah, jump through, what, seven, eight small areas? This is the first time a zombie on the other side. I'll keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. Really? Really? I'm carrying... I knew it. <sighs> Bonnie, get your ass over here and carry this water for me. I'm an 11-year-old girl who is the, in charge of this entire camp. I got this. 
That dude is a beast. Yeah, we're keeping you alive. You can carry so much loot for me. Uh, that's all right. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. Carver was crazy, but at least his shelves were always full. We're gonna have to be conservative as hell. You're right. I thought it looked like so much. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys. Oh, God, what is it now? Oh, stick close. I just walked on in like it owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. No. We can eat raccoon? I'd eat the shit out of that raccoon. No, we are not going after that raccoon. Not like, I mean, just, just that I'd be really happy to eat that <laughs> raccoon. I am starving. No, we are not going after the raccoon. Long way with Rebecca. Yeah. Shoot! Don't let it get away! Leave the raccoon! Bonnie, no. No, we are not going after this. We are not risking our lives for a damn raccoon. No, this is a bad idea. There he is! He's coming your way! Block him! No! He's a cornered animal! Do not go after him! Oh, oh, shit! I ain't going after him. I'll let him go. Shit! Dang it! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Don't shoot! No, 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 no! This is stupid! Thank you. Oh, it had babies! You assholes! You're gonna eat it. Glad I let it go. Have a good day, Mrs. Raccoon. I'm even hungrier than I was before. <laughs> that was kind of fun. I'm sad. I'm not eating raccoon. Well, at least it was kind of fun. Yeah. Huh. I guess it that's was. terrible an idea no, of going after a wild raccoon to with your bare hands and backing it into a corner. I think we saved everybody's life by not grabbing that damn raccoon. Jeez. You're telling me your arms ain't tired? Nope. I could do this all day. Shit, shit, oh god! Breathe like I told you. Okay, 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 okay. And oh here comes the walkers oh to the dinner bell. Oh Baby isn't even here yet, and she's already drawing them. Clem! Clementine! I'm shit. on it. Walkers. How'd they get that close without anyone seeing them? That was Luke. Kenny, we've got to do something. You just keep that baby safe. Whoa, Kenny, don't Kenny, be a hero. We can't stay here. Clementine, where's the place you and Jane found? It's like, I'll show you. It's like 40 feet Someone up the road. Up. Oh, God, there's so many. Mike, the water. On it. Oh, shit, did we just leave Sarah? Sarah, let's go. Oh, good, Sarah's, Sarah's at least conscious. Kenny? You, you have some shit to work through, Kenny, and we're just going to let you beat it through those zombies. Uh, the sharp end, Kenny. Slam, I, I don't think he's okay. He's losing it. I mean, that, that isn't... Let's go, please. He's doing it to protect us. Sure, but... Just, just let the man work it out of his system on non-humans. Okay, now he's going a little overboard. Kenny? Okay, good. Kenny's okay. He's got that out of his system. Now he's not going to go nuts and spaz on one of us. Hey, zombie. Kenny. Oh, hey, you're using the sharp end now. Good job, Kenny. Why would, why would you put the water downstairs? That's about as human as I've felt in a long time. I almost forgot what Clementine. G Jesus, Clem, it's just not. Uh, we were just. Jane. What? Clem, listen. You two were up here having What's sex while we were getting attacked by walkers. Let's get you comfortable. Thank you. I'm glad you two enjoyed yourself. What are you two doing up here, Kenny? What's going on? We got God knows how many walkers out there, which you were supposed to be keeping an eye out for. Hey, hold on a second. Just tell me what's going on. What's going on is you're a reckless fucking moron. I'm reckless. You know, you got a lot of nerve, Kenny. Okay, you guys... The baby. No. Yes. No! Shut up, and let's work on this. Fuck. I'm sorry. Shit. All right, pull down the gate. 
The nice thing about the vent holes is they're right the about eye level. Uh, we should lock you the front gate. Out. Get out there and keep the walkers off us. I'll do this. I've been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs. Shoot them before they get to us. I'm helping outside. outside. I'll help hold them back. Go. I've got Rebecca. I'm go. no good in here. Yeah, see, that's a good gate. We can't let them up here. All right. One. Two. Wasn't aiming at that one, but sure. Four. It's like a 21 gun salute to the baby being born. There are too many of them. Shit! Keep shooting! They are not getting up here! Oh, uh, they're coming through the door! Find something to block this gate! Help us! The cannon. We're using the cannon. You can block the gate with this! I'll help. I'm coming. Yes, we gotta use the cannon for something. Together. Ready? Oh, someone's gonna get bit. Hurry, hurry. Oh, shit. Holy fuck. What the fuck is going on out there? Get back! Get back! Oh, shit! Oh, oh no, no! Jeez! Sarah, hang on! Fuck, fuck, hurry! I can't hold on! Um, well, Sarah, as much as I like you, I like Jane more. We, got, we gotta get Jane up. Take my hand. I'm sorry, Sarah, but it's you or Jane, and I like Jane more. I'm sorry. There's nothing we could have done. She likes looting. Never have gotten her up here. I know, but I wish it could be different. I wish it too. Jane is good at looting and killing some. They know how to climb? Does shit ever end? Well, we need to break the rest of the deck. She's right. She's right. Drop the whole deck. Drop the... Are you fucking crazy? How are we gonna do that? I don't know. Just look around. Let's get the plate. We don't want to hack the cable because the cable will They're swing wildly. Clementine, move it. Come on. Going Still probably going to gonna swing wildly. This may actually kill Mike. Watch it. Son of a nice, bitch. nice. That worked pretty well. No one died. No one got whiplash. That was actually the best that could have happened. Sarah's completely gone and dead, but we made it through with the important members of the group at least. And the baby didn't make it. Well, that's not good. Well, actually, that's... It's not good, but it's also not bad. Rebecca's gonna be in a bad state, but at least we don't have a walking dinner bell running around screaming. Oh, oh, it's okay. Okay. Okay, you know, baby being okay is good, too. Step one, we need to loot a pacifier. Keep that thing in its mouth at all times. Also, now we're kind of stuck up here. But that works, too. And some dumbass decided to put the water on the bottom floor. Looking at you, Mike. Looking at you. Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? He's perfect. Who's a perfect little man? Who's the most perfect little man in the whole <laughs> he world? He doesn't... You are. That's right. You are. Yeah, that, that, that baby well. is definitely not Alvin's. Can't stay here, can we? I've got to rest. It's getting colder. Clementine, I can't think about that right now. You just had a baby. You take some time to just relax. Just a second. I'm fine, I'm fine. But yeah, that is definitely not Alvin's baby. Clem, why don't you give her that coat we found? Sorry, you know, about the color. <laughs> you really think I care about that? Yay! At least she's sensible. Do you want to hold him? Hell no. 
I don't know how. I don't know how. It's easy. Just keep him close and support his head. I am not good with babies. We are going to hold him once. Oh, man, we're going to... Please don't end up being taking care of the baby for the rest of the... Oh. There you go. See, we're even comforting the baby. We are holding this group together. Like a big sister. <laughs> Here, let me take him. You both should rest. Especially you. When's the last time you slept, Kenny? Oh, about two years ago. I'm fine. Plus, somebody's got to watch you while Mama gets her beauty sleep. That baby. You never forget that smell. Okay, you're smelling the baby a little bit creepy, but we're going to let you roll with it. You're feeling a lot better. Bringing new life into the world has made you not want to take yourself out of it, so we're, we're just going to let you smelling the baby slide. We should name him Duck. He shall be Duck the Second. Ah, oh, shit. What are you doing? Listen, I'm sorry. No, 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 no. You are the only competent one in this entire damn group. Come on. The longer I stay, the harder it'll be. Go. Go where? Just away. No, no, you're staying in the group. I did not save you, so you leave. You know, Jamie. Sarah. I don't know how to be around. a big sister. More no. What happened to you two? No. It's not going to happen if you're around you me. You the score. You're a smart kid. But I thought you believed in me. I do. But give it enough time, and everyone's luck runs out. No, you're staying in this group, and your luck is running out before mine. You were staying in this group helping Listen, us loot and kill zombies. When the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's I know I can. everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. I saved you your you life. Like, you do. like it's all one happy family. Oh, and push comes to shove. Can can I go with you? Like I said, no, if I had a choice to go. Can't. It's not how this works. Oh, but I wanted to go on Jane Adventures. You're competent. You like looting. You double tap. You know you take things. Care of yourself. I mean that. Here. Versatility is not overrated. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah. I, um... Uh, you're not I getting away without a hug. No, you're not getting away without a hug. I'm going to guilt trip you so hard you are going to stay. There we go. Turn on the puppy dog eyes, Clem. Stare at her sad as she walks away. No... Also, how the hell did she just get out? Because that means zombies can also get in. Hey, thought you'd be asleep by now. You okay? No. I guess we all got stuff on our minds. I want to tell you that Strange has left. The temperature's dropping. We're low on food. I think we got to stay put for a while. You know, for Rebecca and the baby. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore, see if we can find some place to scavenge. There's a town across the river. But we lost what? Jane, who knows how to loot. Jane left. For good. What? When? Just now. Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? What the fuck? Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? Luke? Of all the childish bullshit. Childish? God damn it, Kenny. You know what? Just lay off. No. You put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two could roll around like fucking teenagers. Look, I made a mistake, all right? No, it's not all right. What do you want from me? Kenny's just trying to protect the group. Well, coming down on me isn't helping. Look, I'm sorry. Okay, I fucked up. But you know what, Jane? She made an offer, and Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you, 
Okay, everything is shit. So forgive me for one day enjoy one moment of something else. Okay. Fine. But this baby, he's what matters now. Got it? So get your shit Honey, together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. We're gonna okay. need a good place to raise him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. We head north, get to Wellington. That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. It might be safe there. Or at least it might be a good stop on the way. Kenny! I'm sorry. Kenny? Kenny, we're gonna need you to let go of the baby sometimes. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. Whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa. What are you talking about? <laughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days at the least. We've got that baby formula. And it won't help the rest of us. And what about shelter? We'll freeze out here. She does need to rest. That's right. She needs to rest. We should wait a few days. Although it is snowing. Maybe that's for the best. We don't want to push Rebecca too hard. I think we can Just all we use a few days of rest. I'll be fine. This is a mistake. Look. We should all try to get some sleep. Look, it's going to take some time to loot, so we can go across the river and loot, and take some day trips, and then she can stay here and be cool. <laughs> because she is looking like she is sick. Good news is the baby's immune system Sorry. is fairly strong right now. Okay, Bex. She looking it's gonna be all right. really, really pale. <laughs> like, I'm turning into a zombie pale? Oh, lovely. Snow. Snow is, like, the worst thing, because sound travels for miles on... Well, when it's actively snowing, it'll actually muffle sound. But crunchy snow means ninja stealth is not possible. Now, I'm feeling... Oh, God. You all right? She's exhausted. We all are. Hey, we waited a few days. I can keep going. Also, Kenny, zip up your damn jacket if you're cold. Seriously. We should have left right away, instead of waiting around. We could have found more food and been someplace warm days ago. We did the right thing. She was in no condition to move. We didn't... We just sat around watching her the whole time? We could still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up. Okay, you're pushing them too hard. I'm just doing what has to be done. Like always. You're not helping anything by arguing. Well, don't forget you agreed with me about waiting to leave camp until today. Yeah, yeah, just just chill out. I should have left with Jane, damn it. But no, Jane wouldn't let me go. She is really looking zombie pale. He's okay. I've got him. No, you rest for a minute. I'll wash him. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? I ain't being weird about it. Yeah, you kind of have been. And not just right now. Kenny knows what he's doing. He's been a dad before. That's not the part I was concerned about. No, I, I, I actually, Hello? in most cases... What is this? Oh, hey, it's our friend. Hello. Please don't kill us with your group. We were nice to you. Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation deck. Before everyone else came. You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? He doesn't look like much. That ain't the point. Hello? Let's Wait. help him. We should help him. We kind of owe him one. Huh. All right. Plus, being nice to him rather than hurting him, very important. If we can do anything to help him. And that might keep his group from coming down on us. Kenny? Kenny. Hello. Your name Come is Clementine. Yes? Hi, Arvo. These are your friends? I'm hoping you can help me now, not like before. All of you can help. Oh, 
How is your sister doing? Sister? Not so good. I need, uh, uh, things for... bandages. I need bandages. Are you hurt? No. Nikaki Arushi! Nikaki Oh, freaking great. Nikaki Buff! Really? Really, Arvo? Great, now the Russian mob has found us. What did your friend say? Let's get him in the position of translator. They think it's funny that you're just a little girl. Robbed? And they want you and your friends to put down the guns so we can take your things. Whoa, whoa, hang on. What the hell? Why get excited? Clementine, you robbed this guy? Maybe we can work something out. What do you mean? We'll double what you lost. Whatever got taken from you, we'll give you twice that much from what we have. Got a bargain with these people. I'm sorry, Clementine, but we are not here to make deals. Kuriko is saying that we will take everything. Okay, no, everyone calm down. We can loot more stuff. It's only things. They don't want to kill us. We will give them our stuff. Just put your guns down. This will be fine. Find my ass. If you put your guns down, we will too. I, uh, I, uh... The fuck is she saying? If I get excited, I will not let them touch that baby. You have a baby with you? When you could not cover a bionic. Suddenly, the maternal instinct of every mobster here. Everyone, calm down. Calm down. Kenny, 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 calm your shit. Don't fucking, don't move. I say it, don't move. They watch us, Umer yet? Oh my God, she died. Oh my God, she died. Guys, guys, she died. Ice picker. No, the shot's gonna trigger everything. No! Damn it, that's why I didn't shoot her. Oh! Why couldn't we have just walked over and ice picked her? No! Oh, I knew everyone was gonna get shot at. No! Oh, why? <laughs> that was so stupid. And fuck you, Arvo. Oh, we should have just dropped, we should have just let them take all of our stuff. We could have replaced it. Oh, man, we wouldn't have had anyone have to die. And I knew she looked pale, like turning to zombie pale. Oh, no. We should have left with Jane. Things would have been simpler. Oh. All right, let's see how we did. 71% of people saved Sarah at the trailer park. You and 54% of people refused to steal from Arvo. Like, that made a difference. I mean, I guess if we had stolen from him, then he might not have been as nice and they would have just shot at us. I don't know. <laughs> Everybody, apparently, 87% of people decided to volunteer to crawl through the ticket booth, even though it was stupid, because we were bound to see a zombie on the other side eventually. You and 93% of people hailed the baby, which may or may not have been bitten by Rebecca, but I think we got her before she ate the baby. So it looks like we are taking care of the baby now. Joy. You and 42% of players decided not to shoot Rebecca. Well, duh. When you're in a standoff situation, you don't just shoot somebody. You walk over calmly, ice pick Rebecca, and be like, guys, we're cool. We're going to drop all of our stuff. You take it, and then you leave. That's how it could have gone down. But no. All right. Well, I guess we will... Uh... See you in the next episode. Holy crap.
Is there a preview, or is it just going to be a black screen? Nope, looks like there's no preview, just the credits. 